Here, we will be demonstrating the four basic operations of arithmetic using nothing but a circle. This is the circle that we will be using, and this is the grid for your visual convenience. The first thing we do is draw a red vertical line segment, followed by a blue horizontal line segment. This, of course, forms four discrete line segments denoted as such. The first operation we can perform is finding the difference and sum. Now, finding the sum is quite easy. The sum of the red line segment and the green line segment is simply the length of the red line segment plus the length of the green line segment denoted by this large yellow line segment. Then we can find the difference. The difference is simply the length of the red line segment minus the length of the green line segment. We can visually represent this by mirroring the green line segment to the other end of the red line segment, leaving us with this nice teal line segment as our final difference. Next, we can demonstrate multiplication and division. Now, you will see that we are using the green line segment as a unit here. 2 times 3, 2 being of course the length of the magenta line segment, times 3 the length of the blue line segment, over 1, the length of the green line segment, is equal to 6, the length of the red line segment. This applies for all line segments. You can do this using both the green line segment as your unit, the magenta line segment as your unit, the blue line segment as your unit, and the red line segment as your unit. If you've been paying attention, you will notice that we can perform the four basic operations of arithmetic with 100% precision using nothing but line segments and a circle. It isn't even necessary to know anything about numbers or arithmetic or fractions. This also all holds true as long as each line segment has an endpoint on their circumference and the remaining points intersect in one point on the interior of the circle. Additionally, the blue and magenta line segments must be collinear, and the red and green line segments must be collinear.